Dear Nigerians, for the past seven years, I have served as vice president under a true Nigerian patriot, a servant of the nation in war and peace, and a man of integrity, President Muhammad Buhari. We have, together, worked through some of the most difficult times in the history of our nation, the rule of law, rapidly advancing our infrastructure development, especially power, roads, railways, and broadband connectivity, providing an excellent environment for businesses to thrive, taking the agricultural revolution to the next level, especially mechanization, and developing the farm-to-table value chain, making sure that the government, its agencies and regulators, particularly all local governments in Nigeria, have been in markets, in factories, in schools, and farms, have been in agricultural, mining, and oil-producing communities, in the Delta, in Kebi, in Enugu, in Bon, in rivers, in Plateau, and Undo, and in all other states of the Federation, listening to the diverse experiences and yearnings of our people, support of fellow Nigerians everywhere in this land and the diaspora, young and old, male and female, in the great and exciting journey that we have ahead of us. I seek your own support. We will, working together, establish by the grace of God, the Nigeria of our dreams, in a few short years. We will build on the foundation laid by our predecessors. We will need to move with much speed where the woman in Wari sees the woman in Jalingo as her sister, where the love of our nation burns alike in the hearts of boys and girls from Goko to Yenogoa, where everywhere in this land is home for everyone, where our diversities, our tribes and faiths Unite us rather than divide us. Let our tribes become one tribe, the Nigerian tribe, where all of fellow Nigerians everywhere in this land and the diaspora, young and old, male and female, in the great and exciting journey that we have ahead of us, I seek your own support. We will, working together, establish by the grace of God the Nigeria of our dreams in a few short years. We will build on the foundation laid by our predecessors. We will need to move with much speed the rule of law, rapidly advancing our infrastructure development, especially power, roads, railways, and broadband connectivity, providing an excellent environment for businesses to thrive, taking the agricultural revolution to the next level, especially mechanization and developing the farm-to-table value chain, making sure that the government, its agencies and regulators, the earnings of our people, have visited our gallant troops in the Northeast and our brothers and sisters in the IDP camps, have felt the pain and anguish of victims in violent conflicts, terrorist attacks, flooding, fire, and other disasters have been in the homes of many ordinary Nigerians in various parts of the country. I have sat with our techpreneurs in links to the challenges of this century, completing the task of universal health coverage for all and strengthening the capacity of states and local governments to deliver on their respective mandates. Above all, front and center of our efforts will be the provision of jobs and opportunities for our young people. I now most solemnly and respectfully seek the support of fellow Nigerians creating a tech economy that will provide jobs for millions of young Nigerians, enhancing our social investment program to a full-scale social welfare program completing the promise of lifting 100 million Nigerians out of poverty within this decade, completing the task of ensuring that all Nigerians, male and female, attend school, reforming our educational system, nationality and perseverance 
towards the vision of a prosperous, stable, and secure nation. I'm convinced beyond doubt that we have the creativity, the courage, the talent, and the resources to be the foremost black nation on earth. Let us now birth the expectations of greatness conceived generations before us. Let us build a Nigeria where the man from Newi sees the man in nationality and perseverance towards the vision of a prosperous, stable, and secure nation. I'm convinced beyond doubt that we have the creativity, the courage, the talent, and the resources to be the foremost black nation on earth. Let us now birth the expectations of greatness conceived generations before us. Let us build a Nigeria where the man from Newi sees the man in nationality and perseverance towards the vision of a prosperous, stable, and secure nation. I'm convinced beyond doubt that we have the creativity, the courage, the talent, and the resources to be the foremost black nation on earth. Let us now birth the expectations of greatness conceived generations before us. Let us build a Nigeria where the man from Newi sees the man in nationality and perseverance towards the vision of a prosperous, stable, and secure nation. I'm convinced beyond doubt that we have the creativity, the courage, the talent, and the resources to be the foremost black nation on earth. Let us now birth the expectations of greatness conceived generations before us. Let us build a Nigeria where the man from Newi sees the man in group unite us rather than divide us. Let our tribes become one tribe, the Nigerian tribe, where all are treated fairly, justly, and with respect, where all are given equal access to the abundant opportunities that God has bestowed on this nation. It is time. God bless and keep our republic and her great people. God bless you.